Well, I just got off work and thought, it's five o'clock, it's between tides. It actually looks pretty low here uh, for being between tides, but it is between tides. And I thought I would come down and look for some sea glass. And look at that, a beautiful sea glass heart to start this adventure. It was supposed to be raining today, uh, however, no rain. Just beautiful sunshine on the shores of Cape Breton Island. I'll have a walk along here, see what I can find today. Well, I got down the beach a little bit more and I found a couple of sharper shards here. Uh, this old bottle bottom and this here, sharper piece here. Now that green sliver and that, of course, sea glass heart, I'm gonna keep. But these other pieces will go right back into the water. And I'll continue on my way down the beach. Oh, and here we have some type of a caterpillar. Wow, so neat. Looks like a little Duracell batter. I'll keep moving along here and let him continue on his way and see what the shore offers up. It is absolutely beautiful down here today. It was supposed to rain However, the sun is shining through. Well, I'm almost at the end of this beach and today I've found a lot of sharper shards here. I'm going to throw these back out there to tumble some more and keep walking along to see what I might be able to find. And so this is pretty interesting. I just showed you recently this hairy little fella here. Well, there's more than one crawling around on the shore here. I've never seen caterpillars crawling around on the seashore. So kind of an interesting uh, find here on the shores today, for sure. Well, I found some more interesting pieces. A uh, piece of an old Javax bottle there. Uh, some other light amber and brown. A bottle top and a couple of triangular whites. Uh, that one there's kind of got a bluish tinge to it. But uh, some beautiful little pieces, albeit they're common. They're still very beautiful. Uh, I'm really taking a fancy to the bottle tops these days. I just, I love the ridged lines on them. And it just, uh, adds to it and makes it a little something different. So I'm just taking a moment here to reflect as I generally do when I come to the shore and then I'll make my way back up the beach after a small break. Well I'm not very far up the beach from where I was and I found a lot of sharper shards along the way so I just wanted to show you um, you don't always find the well tumbled glass on the shores um, and what I like to do is of course throw this back into the ocean so that's exactly what uh, what I will do all those pretty colors flying in. well I'm back where I started I found some beautiful pieces uh, back on my way up the shore, like that waffle white and those limey greens and the beautiful browns uh, and that milk glass as well. But I've come to the end of this adventure and I wanna thank you all for watching. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Check me out on Instagram and Facebook at Class e Glass. I'll leave you now with the sounds of the ocean. 
Have a great day.